So in our baby sign class, we learned a lot of animals, and so we um, will go through the list of some of the animals we learned, and we'll start with our water animals. Um, so we did whale is the letter Y. Put your arm flat, and then you wave it coming back across you. So this is whale. This looks like the whale's tail that moves as it comes back. And you move towards the elbow of the hand that you're using. So that helps people remember which direction. Whale. Um, shark. So shark, you're going to separate your hands. This is your fin, and you move forward. I actually like to do it between this finger. Shark. So shark. Um, fish is just your hand, flat hand, sideways, like you're doing a karate chop but you just kind of wave it forward as it's swimming through the water. Fish. And then dolphin. So you're going to put like the letter R here, and turn it sideways, put up your thumb, and go through the water. It's your dolphin. Okay. Um, our zoo animals. So this is a sign for animal. So hands in towards like just where you're if you rolled your um, shoulders forward, right where that little crease is, so your animals, and you come in. Animals. Um, so we're going to do lion is the big mane. Um, giraffe is a, uh, the C shape of the hand, making the neck that goes up tall. So giraffe. Zebra is um, a horse with stripes. So you do horse striped. Um, Elephant is going to be, you're doing the trunk, so from your nose, you go down and up. Um, monkey is your, in your armpits, kind of, you can alternate or you can go at the same time. You can also, for a gorilla, do it a little bigger as opposed to a little monkey. Um, alligator is going to be, you know, the chomping jaws and teeth. Tiger, so our tiger is like this, you know, our tiger. Um, and then hippo. So hippo, we're going to do um, two little like horned hands on top of each other, open and close. Hippo. Bear. So bear, we're crossing our crossing our arms and then clawing. So much like the love you, but no fists because we're clawing. We're bears. Bear. Um, so those are zoo animals or more exotic animals. Now we're going to do our farm animals. So farm animals would be horse. So horse, you've got the, the index and the middle finger straight up. The thumb comes to the temple of your head. The other two fingers are tucked down and you um, bring them down. Horse. Uh, donkey is the whole hand and it comes down. So donkey is the whole hand. Horse is only the two fingers. Cow is the horn that sticks out to the side. So the cow is only the pinky and it kind of rolls back so cow whereas horse comes forward um, sorry my list just got moved chicken is going to be the thumb and the index finger just like this um, duck is going to be the two fingers so just like the the horse you're using these two fingers but except it's going to you know, be a beak closing over here. So chicken is one finger, duck is two fingers. Rooster is going to be the hand shape of the thumb and these two fingers, but with the fingers separated. So the number three, and you put it on your head and wiggle it a little. So that's rooster. Um, sheep is going to be these two fingers like scissors. Put them on the back of your wrist and move it up your arm, like you're shearing the sheep with big, big sheep, sheep shearing scissors, <laughs> so sheep. Goat is going to be horns up on your forehead and then um, the little hair on their chin. Um, so it can go two ways. You can do the hair first up to the head or you can do the head down here. Um, so you need both parts though to be the goat, so goat. Dog, clap your leg and, and um, snap your fingers is dog, or you can just do dog. Cat, so we're going to be our whiskers pulling away right here at the sides of our face. Cat and mouse. 
So the letter M, just brushing the tip of your nose, or you can just do the index finger, brushing the tip of your nose. Um, both signs are acceptable. Hyena and armadillo are two signs that um, I didn't really put them in any one category, but they were from our Goodnight Gorilla book that are animals. If you have this book, you will probably want to know those signs. So your armadillo is, is your fist with your index finger sticking out to be the tail of the armadillo, and then you give him a shell. So armadillo. Uh, turtle would be the other sign that's very similar, which you've got your thumb up, and then you give a shell, and then your thumb moves as the head of the turtle. Um, and hyena is, you've got these horns, and or this horn-shaped hand, uh, and then it goes across like this, hyena. So these are just all, I set them out here, they're just many, many children's books, the caterpillar, the barn books, the not, not the hippopotamus book, the little piggies, the where's spot. Um, you probably have similar books. There's tons of baby books that have animals in them, so it would be super easy to go through the book and just be showing them the sign for each animal when you get to that page. Um, and that can make it really fun to enjoy that book learning each animal sign.